Terrier Talk. I'm Brian Moore. Instead of the blue line, senior forward McKenna Parker of the women's ice hockey team joins me on the Zoom line. You're never <laughs> offsides here. I can promise you that. McKenna, let's start with last weekend. A two-game sweep over New Hampshire where you ended up totaling two goals and two assists on the weekend, including a career-high three points in that home opener on Saturday. How impressed were you with the way this BU offense got started? Honestly, I thought we had a really good start to the season. I thought that all of us came out flying like right off the bat, which I thought was good. We usually play New Hampshire right off the bat, so it was nice to get back into season and stuff. Not like like they're a really good team, but definitely nice to get back into it and everything. But I definitely thought that the whole team played really well and our offense was great. There's a bunch of girls that really worked offensively. And we have a really in-depth team this year. There's no, like, big all-stars. So I thought all of us worked together really well to put pucks in the net. And we had nine goals, I think it was, in total. So we definitely didn't struggle offensively. So that was yeah, yeah, the nine goals in the two-game series is actually the most since February 21st, February 22nd of 2020, when BU mm-hmm. scored nine goals in a weekend sweep over UConn. Both of those actually were at Walter Brown Arena, while this one was a home-and-home. Well, I wanted to kind of talk about you and the, you know, this line that you're on with upperclassmen and Courtney Correa, a senior, and Haley Blinkhorn, a junior. How much does that help you as you're asked to this year to expand your offensive game? I really like playing with upperclassmen, especially like we all know what we're doing. We've been here for a while now. So, and I've played with Courtney in previous years. So we've always been matched up together. Coach likes playing with like putting us together on a line. I've never played with um, Haley before, but I've, I honestly really liked it. She works super hard. She's always battling, always forechecking really well. So I think our line has really been clicking. We had a really good weekend this past weekend, put some pucks in the net, and we weren't in the defensive zone much. So that was good. So hopefully we can keep that up. But yeah, I really love playing with them. They've, they've been really good. You mentioned the term clicking. Is there a time, whether there was a practice or something, where you felt that that, that trio just kind of hit your stride? Honestly, like not really. Courtney, Courtney and I have always played like together and have played pretty good together. So I knew already knew what it was like to play with her. But um, coach kind of I was on like a different line these past couple of weeks and then coach kind of threw it together like um, a couple of days before the game. So it was kind of just like put the line together and go out there and play. But yeah, I honestly thought our chemistry was really good and we went out there and we battled hard and we had success. So McKenna Parker from the women's ice hockey team is my guest here on Terrier Talk. This has become a common question, but I I think it's so important and really fun to hear the responses, especially from the players. Last year, played a partial season without any fans in the arena. This season, Mm -hmm. an exhibition game already and your first home game so far. What's it like having fans back? And especially for you in your season, uh, your senior year. It's so much more fun. It's so much more fun looking in the stands and seeing everyone and just watching everyone cheer you on and stuff. It's kind of sucked last year when you're like, score your team is trying to get like hyped up and you look at them there's no one and it's all on live stream but I really like it and hopefully my family can come down and watch too so they can be in the stands and yeah I think I think everyone just like plays harder and stuff too when they know that people are there for them and it's just like a support thing too so I love having the fans there and the band the view band especially I love it Good shout out to the BU band as well. And I'm sure you want all the fans at Walter Brown Arena on Friday night when McKenna Parker and the Terriers host the national runner-ups, the Northeastern University Huskies, before completing their season series with New Hampshire in Durham on Saturday. Until next time, I'm Brian Moore. Let's talk again.